We are here for what I like to call now Insights in 10 Redux. Now we tried this out with Mark Critch and nobody died. We're here with Sean Doyle, superstar of television and, 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 and the big screen, here in Lunenburg shooting The Disappeared. But right now we want to know you a little bit better. So we've got, we had four categories. I've lost an envelope, big budget on this website. But nonetheless, these questions were designed specifically for you, Sean Doyle, so for that me. we could know a little bit more about you. And we have three categories for you to choose from. We have sports and leisure. We have life and love. Oh, this is getting nerve wracking. And entertainment. So you just pick whichever category you would like, and we'll ask uh, these 10 questions. Hmm. Again, lots so of So I only pressure. get to choose one. That's right. We, do, we only have time for 10. Um, Entertainment would be the obvious choice. Life and love. Maybe Life I'll and stay love? away from that right now. Okay. No, 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 <laughs> nobody's Sports ever and leisure. Like... Nobody's ever picked that. No, but there's no pressure. We've only done it once. What before. kind of psychology is that? Well, Mark. Nobody's Rich ever did. picked Mark it. Rich Nobody. The one time we did it before has ever well, see, picked we, that. We always had these ten questions. I asked the same ten questions of everybody. Right. And then Mark O'Brien said, "When are you going to shake that business up?" So Mark O'Brien. Yeah, you know Mark O'Brien. He's one of my best friends. I love Mark O'Brien. I hate him. Stop anyway. it. He's sweet. Um, but at any rate, okay. you just need to pick one now. Oh. I feel bad because Science and Nature is probably the one you would have picked. Science and Nature, and I would have chosen. It's not here. Okay. That's ridiculous. <laughs> I can't play this game now. Come on. I'm going to do the least likely for me. Okay. Sports and Leisure. Sports and Leisure. Okay, now I ask you these this questions. This is not what I would normally choose. They are rapid fire now. So as quickly oh. as you can answer these questions. I'm because, very slow. Well, no. <clears throat> Sports and Leisure, our first question. Oh, my God. So we know a little bit more about Sean Doyle. Store bought or homemade? Oh, and I have to just uh, choose the answer? That's right, sir. Oh, uh, store bought. Dream car. Mmm, Tesla. All electric car. A what now? It's a Tesla. It's Tesla. an all electric sports car. It goes zero to 60 in three and a half seconds. Sweet. And you just plug it in. Plug it in. Love it. Okay. Now, eight minutes on the edge of the CN Tower in stormy weather or eight minutes in the ring with boxer Floyd Mayweather. CN Tower. Is that true? God, yeah. Okay, stormy weather. Doesn't uh, matter. I'm sure I'd be harnessed in properly. <laughs> okay. They walk around the CN Tower now. They well, I know, I saw that. Did Rick Mercer and Jan Arden, did you see that? They did it? Yes. Oh. Very funny. I'm sure. Funny stuff. All right, have you ever read the ending of a book first? Yes. Can you remember the book? 100 Years of Solitude. Gabriel Garcia Marquez. And why'd you do that? Because someone said the ending of the book is so beautiful, and I wrote it. And, and I, I'll, I'll, I'll screw up the line right now, but it's something like, uh, a family a family begins a dynasty, and they end up being eaten by ants. Cheery. How is that beautiful? Do you want to still stalk me? Well. <laughs> <laughs> How important is footwear to you? Footwear is everything. <laughs> True. Yes, it is. Is it really? Yeah. What are you wearing now? Well, right now I'm wearing a pair of leather shoes uh, what are they? that make me feel young oh, and hip. They're, they're super cool. Yeah. You're very bendy, eh? Oh, yeah. I'm a bendy guy. <laughs> wow. No, but shoes are very important. Uh, footwear is important for a character, you know. If you don't have the right shoes on, you're screwed. I'm Sean not Joel, even joking. Are you, you're not joking. Not joking, no. You so have to you, make sure. That's your method. I don't even know what that means, but all the cool people say it. Yeah, method. Okay. Um, greatest athlete ever. Greatest athlete ever. Oof, I would have to say uh, Muhammad Ali. So you are a boxing fan? No, just because in principle. Mm, are you a sports fan um, at all? Uh, very little. I do a lot of individual sports myself. I'm not really a sports guy. I don't watch it. But, you know, he had such an influence on race relations at a certain time that I can't help it. Okay, fair enough. And it was a really cool movie by Michael Mann. Yes. Mayer. Yeah, and, and Will Smith. Who's that? Wasn't he in that movie? Yes. Okay. I love him. Uh, <clears throat> What was the last thing you ordered off a room service menu? Oh my God! What was the last time that I was in a hotel like that? Really? Where are they got well, you held up here now? In a there ain't no room service, girl. <laughs> Let me tell you, the last the last time I ordered room service was in Con. Oh. I was in Con for the world television market for Endgame, and I would imagine the last thing I ordered was certainly a bottle of champagne. Ooh. As well as whatever edible stuff, because because nice. I wasn't paying for any of it. Right. Well. So. Fair enough. Favorite holiday and why? Christmas. Because I love Christmas trees. All right. CFL or NFL? I don't swear, so I don't use. 
abbreviations <laughs> to okay. anything. All right, and finally, in our sports and leisure category, Sean Doyle, if you could play on any team in any sport, what would it be? The greatest ping pong team <laughs> in the history of this, because then I'd have be really skinny and lithe. I'd have to be to play that Very game. Very hip. Have yeah. you heard about this ping pong? I'd probably game? have to be Asian, Come because. Back. Asians are the top players in the well, world, right? True. They're fast. Right. So, yeah, I'd, I'd be it's on the ping pong It's very in team. now, ping pong. Is it? Yes. Have you heard about this? As no. a workout. I'm not kidding. As a workout. I just saw that somewhere. There's an incredible uh, um, video on YouTube where you can watch Bruce Lee playing ping pong with his nunchucks. And he's hitting the ping pong back to a champion ping pong player with his nunchucks. I'm not joking. It's true. I, I got to get out more. <laughs> <laughs> John Doyle, and now you know a little bit more about the movie. Or not. Well, I liked it. <laughs>